I'm Anthony Hudson. Today we are coming to you from the Adelaide Oval. We couldn't have asked for better conditions here. You'd want to win the toss today, given the type of breeze we're seeing at the moment. Looks like the fans have opted for the lounge chair for this encounter. And joining me in the box for some special comments will be Gary Lyon. G'day, Hutto. I've been waiting for this match all week. Hitting the turf today will be Adelaide and Fremantle. Full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. It's a battle in the three man from Fulda. Their forwards bring the pressure inside 50. It's going to give them a massive chance of walking out on top. and the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The captains make their way to the centre circle for the coin toss. The Dockers kicking to the right of screen. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. Just waiting for the opening siren now. We're set to begin things here at the Adelaide Oval. McHenry receives the ball. It's a turnover. Ace wins it back. Couldn't complete the mark. Gets a quick kick away. Finds this and marks well. Sinks the slipper into it. Ends up marking uncontested. Got the hands free. Handball finds keys. Just gets it onto the boot. Steady hands there as he holds back. Gets it away. He gets his hands on the foot. Wilson read it best. Umpire calls for the ball. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Ace slick with the hands. Mateer, hurry kick. The ball is turned over. Wants to keep it moving. The handball hits the target. Kick goes inside the 50. Intercepts the ball well. Kicks it out at the fence. Takes a strong mark. Releases by hand. The umpire calls for a stoppage. Swatson has it now. Getting in the way was Keys. Hurried kick. Chera takes it strongly. A short by hand. Young grabbed it clean. Young will be the recipient of the free. Moves it by foot, both sides. Failed to get a score so far. Good grab there for Bob. That kick covering some territory. Marks that ball uncontested. Goes by foot. Blair, the better man there. The better. Not sure if he has the journey from here. Move it on. He gives it a ride. Looks okay off the boot. Listen to the fans celebrate as he drives that through. Of course, Hunter. Lee loves that goal. And we have the first goal of the match. We resume hostilities. Darcy dumps it clear. Slams it onto the boot. Wilson got hands to it. Penetrating handball. McHenry a bit too casual with the tackle. 
ball spells, has to do better than that in the mark contest. Move it on! But strives the kick. Keys hangs on the right Decides to kick. Hands that ball to the opposition. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Cox will be upset with that. Gives a don't argue. Monday just through it. Lynch with a chance if he can keep his cool. Goes for the goal. The kick towards goal. It's a huge kick. And it goes all the way. He puts through his first goal. Gets him a reward for his efforts. Back in the middle now. Wins the ruck duel. He gains possession with quick hands. Receives the handball and takes off. Great control there. Two gathers it now. Turned it over. Darcy going for number one. Sends it home. Teammates rush over. Fremantle with their first of the match. Darcy does well. Clean from the half point. Clean pick up by McPherson. Intervening brilliantly was Cox. Cox has resources out wide. Nice work for Kelly. Goes with the kick. The mark has been taken. With a driving kick. Good mark by O'Brien. Just gave it away. He looks like he needs a spell. Chips it towards half forward. The umpire will ball it up. Winning it was Darcy. Ball picked up. The ball's not loose. Wins the race to the ball. Looks up with a kick. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Go for distance with the kick. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. He's in his possession. Fighting hard was cleared. Just put it on the boot. He takes the mark. McPherson moves it now. Finds a target. Blair gets onto that one. Kick by Camel. Ends up turning this ball over. Hewley puts it on the boot. The mark will be paid. Moves the ball by foot. Terrific mark there. McCadden spears the ball. It's cut off by Cox. Marks all the line. Looks to move it by foot. They chase after the loose ball. This kick to tie up the game. That's a well executed kick for a goal. He's absolutely loving it. Why not? He acknowledges the crowd. Well, it's quarter time and we're still at square one. What are the stats? The second term ready to get underway. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. A chance for Bight. Missed the target. O'Brien gets on the end of that handball. It'll be a ball up. Darcy thrashes it. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Clears the contest. Slams it onto the boot. Stir grabs that one. Moves the ball by foot. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Sees it out of play. Thrown in now. Hammers it with the ball is Darcy. O'Brien crosses off the tackle. Puts boot to ball. 
Walker couldn't snap it. He gives away a free for in the back. Elects to kick. A good mark out of the circumstances. Goes by foot. Darcy didn't mark it. The loose ball scooped up. Straw heads onto the ground. Ball up calls. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Nails the goal. He's enjoying that goal. That's three in a row for Fremantle. The margin is six. Darcy with the hit. And now two. Quick handball. Slips the handball to Butts. A chance for Keys. Crocker pushes his opponent off with one hand. And the ball bounces across the boundary line. Ball back into play. Straw got a fist to it. And now it's a ball up. Darcy hurls it away. Releases the handball. He can take off after that handball. Couldn't quite with the mark. Puts on a big hit. Lock sends the drop down on its way for another goal. They get around him after that effort. Fremantle have kicked the last four goals. Fremantle, two goals up. Jones doesn't get low enough and gives away the free. Decides to kick. Bewley runs after the ball, finding the ball with ease. O'Brien gets onto the ball. Law fires it up to the square. Goes wide from behind. Fremantle, but 13. Kelly to kick it in. He gives chase to the footy. Just landed in his back. Needs a bit of a rest. Looking to kick goal number two. Drop back through the goals. This one gives them a bigger lead. Celebrating hard. Fremantle had five unanswered goals. 19 points the difference. Thumps it clear. With the ball is O'Brien. McAdam making his way onto the field. Now we've got a ball up. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This is a classic game in the scene right now. Didn't get low enough with the tackle. He drives it. He looks like he needs a spell. Brayshaw has a great set of hands. Goes by hand. Mundy keeps coming. He wins possession. Jones with the intercept. Shrugs the tackle. Trying to avoid everything out there. Dishes it off. Keys gets him hard. Henry going for number one. It looked impossible, but he made it work. That pushes the lead further out. He loved that one. Fremantle, Cleek, Adelaide by 25. Back with another set of bounce. Punches are clear. McAdam slowing down now. Might be in need of a rest. We'll have another ball up. Thrashes it. He's got the footy in his hands. McAdam applies a bump. Lobs the handball. The ball in the hands of Tavener. There'll be a ball up close to goal. O'Brien with the punch. No doubt about that. So, what could Fremantle do with this opportunity in front of goal? Hill is within range. Moving on. He takes a... The lead is now 
26. Unsure of their next move. Well collected. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Matias celebrating hard. Fremantle have kicked seven unanswered goals. The lead is now 32. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. The Dockers are doing a good job at getting the ball forward. They lead the inside 50s and they're creating plenty of problems for the opposition defence. Back in the middle to resume play. Thump by Darcy. Collects the loose ball. Gets the handball away. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. Should be relatively straightforward from here. Going for goal number one. It's going to be close. He's put that one through. They will continue to keep pushing to get back in this game now. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Back in the middle now. Punched away. McAdam looking a bit sluggish out there. Darcy moves it by hand. Going for goal number one. What a kick, and he puts it through. This kick stretches the lead. A time to celebrate, and don't they get around Hill. Fremantle with the edge right now over the Crows. Darcy thumped it clear, goes by hand, receives the handball, and takes off. Kick on the way. Oh, what about that? That was really special. That's his first. They increase their lead. Tabernacle celebrates with the fans. Umpire ready to resume play. Tap down. He has the ball. Darcy gets on the end of this. Kelly on the end of the turnover. Easily takes the mark. McHenry uses it by foot. Chera kicks out of the congestion. Hurried kick. Doing well with the mark. a touch to the ball he's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest looks up with a kick Henry takes the mark plays on quickly goes with the kick Matera had it, lost it releases the handball, gives it to McHenry McPherson finds possession the mark is taken by Lynch Slams it on the boot. Takes a nice mark. It's half time. What have you got to say, Gaz? Fremantle have controlled the play well and deserve this lead at half time. Let's check out the stats. Ready to begin proceedings in the second half. The game is back underway. One it down. He gets his hands on the footy. Charges with intent. Blair dishes it off. Didn't get away from that tackle. Brilliant chase. Thank you, Ohio. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Bounce works for Stir. Gets on the end of this. We'll have a ball up close to the boundary line. Thump clear. Didn't fumble. Using every ounce of energy he has left. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Look at them celebrate that effort. Fremantle have three in a row. Now they lead by 44. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. The Dockers are on top in the turnovers. They don't allow the opposition easy possessions, and that's why they're on top. Hands that ball to the opposition. Takes possession. Drops the ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gas. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. 
The umpire will ball it up. O'Brien won the hit out. We'll have another ball up. O'Brien won the hit out. Fans crossing their fingers, hoping he can put this one through the big sticks. 35 metres out. He looks like he needs a spell. He was so of that goal with no one left his boot. He's enjoying every second of it out there. Congratulated by his teammates. We resume hostilities. Taps it down. Mops up the loose ball. Jones now heading to the bench for a break. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. The sting has been taken out of the game right now. Right. The umpire calls for a stoppage. Darcy on the tap. Needs a bit of a rest. Dug it out. Hacking it out of there. Walker missed an opportunity to mark. Now we've got a ball up. Darcy guides it down. Hill wants to keep it moving by hand. Well collected on the bounce. Constant pressure and rewarded. Lowe couldn't hang on to the ball. Slick with the hands. He can take off after that handball. Decides to keep it alive. Couldn't complete the play. Ball out of bounds. Toss back into play. O'Brien just slaps it down. Henry just threw it. Uses it by foot. Nice mark under pressure. 30 metres out. Matera shouldn't miss from here. Using every ounce of energy he has left. This is that ball through the big sticks. Yes, I know. And that puts them further in front. Pretty happy with that one. Fremantle with the ascendancy over Adelaide, leading 74 to 18. Slapped away. He wins possession. Jones steals possession. Blair sends it clear of the contest. The boundary umpire will toss it back in. Umpire tosses it in. O'Brien aims for his man on the ground. Crocker throws the ball away. Uses it now. It's a foot race to get this one. Well, this game is really getting out of hand. Darcy slaps it away. Gets the loose ball. Finding the loose ball was Jones. Stands tall and marks. He's in charge of the ranking points. The opposition need to get a hold of him. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Long kick there. Will it go all the way? It does. O'Brien delivers with his first goal. A much needed goal for Penelope. He celebrates hard after that. Hammers it. Taken by O'Brien. Penetrating handball. He's got the football now. On its way. He's excited about that. Yes, I know. Key getting the crowd involved. Looking to find a way back in this. Centre bounce. It's been a clearance game, and right now, the Dockers are on top in that area. Hill keeps it moving. They'll be pleased with that effort. A nice long goal. The lead has been increased by Tavener. He's excited about that one. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. He did really well there and gets the reward. Fremantle have been extremely well organised at the stoppages and it sees them being able to win the ball from the clearance. We're back in motion. Big thump from Darcy. Brace your brushed off easily. It's a turnover.
There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Darcy palmed it down. Ryan with the ball. He just sets the ball well. With a driving kick. Kelly going. Three man talk. Haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Spent that one before he earned it. He gains possession. Finds his man. Likes his chances from here. Tabernacle with a massive goal. Puts through his third goal. Miles all round. Fremantle have kicked back-to-back -back goals. 56 points the difference. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Fremantle are forcing the opposition to give it to the open player. They aren't allowing them any room to move forward. About to resume hostilities. Thump clear. Up for grabs for Pill. Just put it on the boot. Takes a simple grab. Chooses to play on. A spearing kick. Gets a quick kick away. He has to hold on to those. He's got the footy in his hands. If they kick this, they give themselves a chance. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around? in a really tricky situation. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Fremantle are doing a great job of applying pressure and creating turnovers. It's allowing them plenty of opportunities. About to resume play. One down. O'Brien gets the ball. Ball up in the centre square. This game is out of hand and could go downhill even further. Brace York was taken high in the tackle. Sinks the slipper into it. Wilson marks uncontested. Fremantle have the lead, but they're allowed plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. A bit too hard with the push, and it's a free kick. Got boot to ball. Takes a simple grab. Fremantle have the lead, but they're allowed plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Bach tucks it into the pocket. Finds himself in space and marks. Young clears the danger for now. Intercepted by Pierce. The fans hope this one goes through to give him a glimmer of hope. He celebrates hard after that. The Crows produced back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it. Adelaide trailing by 44. Fremantle fans will be hoping they can hold on and get a memorable victory today. Here's Gary to take a look at the key stats. Fremantle are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Thanks for that, Gary.
have one quarter of footy ahead of us. Let's go. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Clears the contest. Ace grabbed it clean. Sends it clear of the contest. The ball ends up with Long. 50 metres from home. Almost directly in front here. If they just maintain position and hold onto the ball for a moment, they should be able to hold on here. Drop punt straight through the middle. Three goals so far. Great start. Pretty happy with that one. The margin is 50. Umpire ready to resume play. Wins the ruck duel. Aish needs a chance to rest. Gets a hand to the ball. Just gave it away. Manufactures the handball. He slams it towards goal. Top line. to play home from the tier. His teammates rush over. This margin is becoming a bit of a task to peg back now. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Adelaide could giving up too much free space on the opposition. They're allowing them too much room and easy contested ball. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Doing well was Aish. Darcy finds his man on the move. An easy grab for Clark. 40 metres out. Needs a bit of a rest. He decides to go behind. The kick towards goal. The Dockers with a handy break. They lead Adelaide 104 to 42. Fight onto the ball. Fight coming off for a spell. We'll get the ball tossed back into play. It's just smashing out there at the moment, and it could get worse. Gallucci collects it. Gallucci throws the ball away. Puts it on the boot. Chera finds the ball on the move. Releases by hand. Long gets it down. Loot clean from the half volley. Brayshaw finds a way to hang on. Showing some really good pressure there. A chance here to convert the Bremen. It's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. He looks like he needs a spell. No problems with that kick from Gurley. They get around him after that effort. March is starting to really blow out. Guided down nicely by O'Brien. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Stern is the body to take that mark. 60 metres out. No. He might kick a goal. On its way. Drop part sides between the big sticks. He's enjoying that goal. Fremantle, Covert Adelaide. Fight 74. Thrashes it. McHenry on the ball. Oh. Ball up in the centre square. Punched away. Is in his possession. Ace has the ball. Ball up in the centre square. Tap down. Hill wins the foot race. Turned it over. Tabernard gets in the way. He heads for home. Looks okay off the boost. That's a big goal. What an effort. He's excited about that one. Fremantle Flea is now 80. Back in the middle now. Guides it down. Has it now. Jones unable to lay the tackle. McPherson couldn't keep his hands on it. Hill running off for a break. They just need to find a way to work back into the game right now. Fremantle have gone on top of the clearances, but they're not hitting the scoreboard. If they can find a way to use their clearance ability better, they will find themselves in front. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Long puts another one through. Smiles all round. Fremantle have kicked the last seven goals. The lead is now 86. Fremantle can make
making the most of their ruck dominance. It's one area of their game that seems on top here. Five there to mop up. Jones couldn't stick the tackle. Fighting hard was Brayshaw. Quickly onto the boot. The boundary line wins. It'll be a throw in. Thrown in now. Won the hit out. Matera charges with intent. Off hands. Rushes with the kick. Can't take the mark. Bewley needs to lift. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match, Hunter. Huh? Fremantle are taking advantage of the Ruckman's ability. It's giving them first use at the stoppages and forcing the opposition to defend. We'll get a ball up. Fremantle, Cork are getting first use from their Ruckman. Scoops up the ball. Henry gives it to the player running past. Matera gives it a Now they lead by 87. Kelly with the responsibility of kicking it in. Butts has it. Moves it by foot. A strong mark in the pack for Bakers. 50 metres out. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. He sums up the situation and delivers. Of course, Hunter. This lead getting bigger now. Bakers love kicking that one. Centre bounce. Won it down. O'Brien comes away with the ball. Stern runs them down. Fails to fend off the tackler. Great attack on the ball carrier. Chose to kick it. Didn't have time to break strike to mark that. Gets the handball away. Lynch rushes with the kick. Close the gap to 92. Ready to bring it back into play. Pierce plays on. With a driving kick. Off hands from Crocker. I haven't seen him for a while, I guess. He needs to find a way into this game. Belucci enjoying that goal. Adelaide behind by 86. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Fremantle have been terrific at finding space to move the ball. Their ability to find a player in space is first class and it sees them in charge. We're back in motion. Slapped away. Opportunity for O'Brien. Oh, what a hanger there. Chera drives the kick. Great mark in the pack. Looks up with the kick. Gets into a good position to take that. Fife has resources out wide. Wilson does well to mark. Wilson sends one up towards the wing. A race for the loose ball. Wins the race to the ball. Walker winds up and goes long. Lynch drops the mark. They were down at one stage, but never out, and found a way to... Final scores are 135 to 49.